Hi, I'm Dr. Kenneth Fink. I'm a medical oncologist in uh, Wilmington, North Carolina, the Zimmer Cancer Center, New Hanover Regional Medical Center. Uh, early signs of lung cancer are, are important and for, for, for patients, especially smokers, uh, to know about and think about. Um, anyone who's smoking is going to be at very high risk for, for lung cancer. Of course, uh, your, your doctors and, and perhaps your relatives and everyone else who, who, who knows you will, if you're a smoker, will tell you to stop smoking. We all know that that's uh, going to cause cancer um, for, for a high percentage of patients. Early signs of lung cancer are, are very common, things like coughing, uh, maybe some chest pain. These are all rather common symptoms that people have. Perhaps the, the more important thing is, is are the symptoms uh, persistent? Are they going on for, for a week or two weeks or, or even months at a time? Um, if that's happening, then that's certainly a time to, to, to get into to see a doctor, get an x-ray. Um, we, we'd like to be able to detect a, a lung cancer before any symptoms occur or before any signs uh, because once there are symptoms, there could be uh, perhaps uh, more invasive disease tumors that have gotten bigger and are causing more problems. But still, if a person's just having a, a bit of a cough, um, if they see a little bit of blood uh, when they cough, a little bit of blood in their sputum, and that's just not clearing up, obviously that would be, uh, be much more concerning. It still could be an early sign and, uh, and it still needs to be, uh, a person would definitely need to be checked for uh, if that were occurring. Something like chest pain could also be going on. There could be, and there, there are definitely some pain fibers in the lung, and as a tumor grows in the lung, it can definitely cause a little bit of discomfort. So I'd say chest pain and cough, a little blood in the sputum, uh, those would be the earliest signs of lung cancer.